Oh, what's going on everybody Z here and welcome to Two Point Campus. Now, if you guys remember a while back, we played Two Point Hospital. It was a fantastic time. And today we're gonna hop in to Two Point Campus. We're gonna make our own school. We're gonna have all kinds of crazy classes, things like that. It's gonna be a fun time. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Let's go ahead, let's just start a new game. Oh my gosh, we're going right into it. Wait, wait, wait. There's magic? This looks like such a fun time. Okay, all right, let's get on into this. Okay, so, uh, did you know, so students will gain XP. Okay, cool, something, something or other. All right, so we're gonna start off at a basic school. That's how we always start off these games. And we're gonna help them get along, learn the basics here, and then hopefully get into our own school. So, I'm Albert Crank, your own personal advisor, and I'm here to help. You may not have any experience as a campus administrator, but the people at Freshly Hot, uh, oh, well, not Freshly, Freshly County College are eager to give you a chance. I'm not sure what this is about them, but hey, let's head to Freshly Meadows and get you started on your academic empire. This sounds like so much fun. Um, okay, so this country psychology has low expectations and a nice canal. It's the perfect place to start your career. Uh, starting funds, 500,000. Okay, so we're going to start like a story mode here. Uh, this country psychology has low expectations and, and a nice canal. It's perfect. Where's the nice canal? Oh, it's right here. Okay, I got it. I got it. Got it. Okay. A university is oh. not something that one simply opens, like oh, a yeah. savings account or a jar of pickles. Any self respecting <laughs> institution was doubtlessly opened long ago by dignified people who wore bowler hats and spoke via subtitle. The world is a creation of the past. And it is our job to keep it all going and try not to touch anything. Okay. Try not to touch anything. Um, all right. Welcome to the fresh, uh, freshly in meadows where life moves slowly and expectations are lowly. The two point countryside is a perfect place to start your career. Learn the ropes. Fantastic. Um, Scientography? Scientog Scientography? Scientography? Is it Scientography? That's Scientography. Wow. Okay. Student intake 10. Okay. Warning. Stupid <gasps> questions will oh. make you look stupid. <laughs> Welcome to campus. Before you start turning out your geniuses, you need to learn the basics of campus management. Try to move the camera around. Have a good look. Okay. We've done that. Look around. Pan. Rotate. Zoom. And where's the pitch? Pitch. There we go. Okay. My gosh. We're doing so good. Build a science lab. Um, a scientography course. Start by building a science lab. Okay, so now we're gonna. Oh, well, okay, I guess we can't even get a first look at things right now. I was like, oh, we're gonna get a first look at different types of classrooms and stuff. So, um, okay, scientography lab. Uh, let's go ahead and put that all the way in this corner here because why not? And we'll put it right there. Okay, and then what do we need to put in there? It looks like we need some kind of uh, some kind of wall thing. And then we need this machine. Students are reminded that there's no such thing. And then as we need time. there's no such thing as free time. Okay, let's see here. I want to I want to rotate this bad boy. How do we rotate this guy? All right, I'll put that there. Here ourselves a screen there. Oh my gosh, yes, the plants. You always have to have plants. Okay. Do you want to sell one invalid item? No. What's the invalid item? Oh, it's probably... Okay, so here, we'll just do that then. Good to go. Oh, look, we got a science lab, people, where we can come in here and do sciencey things. Now, let's hire a teacher to run our first scientography class. All right, this is going to be fantastic. Q 
Hugo Manners, and my God, he's dabbing in his photo. That means he's got to be something good. Recruitment fee, $4,200. Scientography, 70% teaching skill. Lollygagger, moves slower than most. Bin blindness, drops litter. Been here before. Themselves. All right, well, you get in there then. All right, uh, great work. We now have everything we need to run our Scientography course. Uh, when you're ready, start next year and welcome your first year of students. That's it. We're going to this whole area. <laughs> we're going to have one room. Oh, my gosh. OK, I love it. It's the Harrison Wolf Show, baby. All right. Start next year. Let's do this. All right. Complete a Scientography course. Where are we at? The students are arriving on campus. Are you nervous? Why am I nervous? Oh, here we go. OK. Look at these young minds that we're gonna fill full of knowledge. Oh, they're gonna be so happy to be here. Um, okay, so we have some kind of calendar here. I'm gonna guess that this is gonna have to deal with like when students are in class and when they're not. So maybe the- The academic year is starting. The academic year is starting. So yeah, I'm gonna guess that that's, these, these blue students days are gonna be something or, um, I don't know. Students should check in before trying to learn. Okay. Is any? Oh wow! Look at we got this guy. Now What's up, guy? For Scientography. Scientography. Okay. Is anybody gonna learn? So oh, we got some people. Look at that. Students in the very first class. Who knows what will happen? Okay. So our our countdown's going here. Event schedule. Now we're bubbling. This means fizziness. Year one science lab. Science lab. Oh, lecture theater. It says what classes are going on and during what times. Oh, holy moly. What are they doing? What are they making? Oh, tell me they're making something like, I don't even know. Uh, as students learn, they'll get experience points or XP, which will increase their academic level. What are they making? I have no idea. It's a science hub. It's got to be making something. Hey, look at we got a monthly profit. Hey, okay, so we completed our first class. Uh, they did the students pass the first class. Sadly, they didn't do all that well. It seems a number of them were distracted by one need or the other. A student ha that has everything they need will be more happy, less distracted, and able to focus on their studies in a enthusiastic and cheerful haze. Okay, so what did people need? Um, a student's needs such as their thirst, toilet comfort, will affect their overall happiness. Happy students perform better in classes and earn more XP. Okay, so we need to um, we need to improve our campus. Okay, so happiness, tired, feeling the giggles, traits, dark or iron bladder. Toilet comfort decreases slower than most toilet need. Okay. Uh, the key to campus hospitality is remember that they're the three RS students need somewhere to relax themselves, to rest themselves and to relieve themselves. Sure. Two of those might sound might be the same thing, but it does sound convincing. Let's build a dormitory and a bathroom to keep people comfortable. Oh, so we're going to build a dormitory. Um, okay. Hold on. Let's get rid of this guy. So where do we build the dormitory at? Is there is there somewhere that it wants me to build a dormitory? I don't see anything flashing right now. Alright, so just build a dormitory. Okay, so a dormitory. Oh, can that go within the school? Oh, it sure can. Okay, well, since we're starting down here, let's go ahead and start down here. Um, let's make this the dormitory. And can we have multiple? Oh, it has. It only has to be a two by two. Hold on a second. Okay, it only has to be a two by two room. Wow. Um. All right. Well, hold on a second. If that's the case, put the door there. Okay, so we'll make this super small because we can always add more of them. 
Um, hold on, we need to get a bed in here. Let's see, let's get a bed and a wardrobe of sorts. Uh, well, let's put this right there. That looks good. We did it, we got a dormitory. They don't even have a window. <laughs> No windows for you. Okay, so dormitory there. Let's put the uh, let's put the restroom. Let's put a let's put the uh, bathroom like right in here. We're gonna fill this with dormitories. We're gonna fill this with bathroom over here. All right, so one bathroom. It's only has it only has to be a two by one. What? That is fantastic. That is absolutely wonderful. Um, well, we could get more in here though if we made it bigger, right? Like, what if we did? Like, what if we just did this whole section here? Move that there. And then we'll grab some more of, uh, grab some more of these. Like that. What is this? Door. Okay, we have a door. Um, we could put a sink in here. Um, a hand sanitizing station, possibly. And some plants. That is... This right here is just the fanciest thing. Can we throw a window in here? Oh, heck yeah, we can. Perfect. Look at that bathroom. That is a fancy. Oh, we got a shower room now. Holy moly. Okay, student happiness. Place one cheesy gubbins, gubbins machine and place one blurp machine. Oh, that needs to go right here, right outside the bathroom. Okay, um, this must be the cheesy thingy McDealier. So, you know, actually, Let's put that in here and then a burp machine. Perfect. And then can we throw. Do we have a trash can? Pearl of Wisdom. We need a trash can. Aha. Trash can. You always have to have a trash can. And what is this? Hand sanitizer. Never heard of it. <laughs> we definitely need these because people like to get sick, especially nowadays. All right. Um, hire a janitor. Okay, cool. So that looks good for us. I'm sure be living in their own filth. Luckily, we have a very little say in the matter. Okay, let's hire a janitor and place a bin. Keep things nice and tidy. Fantastic. Okay, so one janitor. Penelope Glasson. Scientography. Scientography requires a skill to teach. What is this? Scientography. I want a janitor. Um... Required to teach Scientography, 70% teaching skill. Oh, I don't have a... Oh! Janitors! Okay. Uh, well, you look like you have the best. Happy thoughts. Aerodynamics boost movement speed. And, oh yeah, you look like you're like the perfect person. Let's hire you. I mean, you're kind of expensive. But I feel like, you know, a quality worker is probably good. Alright. Wait, that is not at all. You don't even have a face. Laura Solomon. You don't look even like a Laura Sol. I don't even know. It is what it is. Okay. Pass a Scientography class with a grade C+. Okay. All right, hold on. Let's see what we got going on here. I'm tired. Needs stressed. And peckish. Wants something to eat. Okay, so let's do this. Before we get going any further, let's go ahead and let's, let's build another dormitory. Right there. Put a door there. Let's go ahead and uh, basically do the exact same thing. Here. Um, and then, you know what? Let's put one of these little fancy boards in here. Why not? Oh, can we throw, can we throw a, a window in here? There we go. Okay, that looks good. Uh, and then let's throw a, uh, a little trash bin right there. And then some plants. We gotta make this place, like, fancier, you know? Perfect. That looks good. Okay, so we got another dormitory. Um, and then we've got in- we got a snack area. We've got this area. We haven't- I don't- I haven't seen anybody with... Needing, like, a shower room yet. What a nice canal. Everybody's on about this stupid canal. Where's this canal at? Where are you? Oh, it's right here. It's this canal right here. It's overlooking this thing. Okay. 
Uh, let's go ahead. And let's see how they do in the next class. So next class is going to be wait lecture theater one. Oh, lecture theater's right here, right? Lecture theater one. Okay. Students are reminded that you don't have to ask to go to the toilet. Uh, you know what? I don't have a teacher for this classroom. I don't think I have a teacher for that classroom. So I'm actually going to, I'm curious to see how this is going to work because this is a separate room from the other one. Oh my gosh. These guys are already trying to go to sleep. Holy moly. Thin blindness drop letters. They're like, what the heck? There's so many of them hanging out in the room. There's okay, guys. There's supposed to be one person per room. There's four in that room right now. What the heck is going on here? All right, hold on. Uh, bursting needs a rest. Movements. <sighs> Wants a toilet. The toilet's literally right there. Students are reminded to be in two places at once. Okay. Um. So it looks like we need more building. Uh. More more sleeping areas. So let's go ahead and get those built real quick. And apparently, since everybody will use the same sleeping area, let's just go ahead and do. Let's just do something like that, like this, and get everybody into one area as humanly possible. So, okay, there's all of those. How many people can we fit in this one room? Okay, so there's that. Let's go ahead and get, um, we get a wardrobe in here couple wardrobes and then we'll get oh a hand sanitizer because we don't want people getting sick in there and then we'll also put a desk over here in the corner no we, yes we will so that way they can do whatever they need to do perfect that is fantastic now they have look at that, Students are reminded that this is oh the look at part. them they're all gonna be able to sleep they're all gonna be so happy now wait what is this Oh, I thought that was a drone or something. So whoever gets these dormitories is the lucky ones. These ones right here, they're not having a good time. How does everybody need the bathroom? There's a bathroom literally right here. I have no idea. Okay. Um, and also, I don't know if my teacher's going to take over this area or not, but I guess we'll find out. All right, it looks like our bathrooms are barely keeping up now. <laughs> so let's do this. Let's put a let's put a bathroom in right here. <laughs> because why not? That looks like the most wonderful spot for a bathroom, does it not? It looks it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. Uh, can I put this anywhere in here that it'll work? No, I literally can't even put a sink in there. Um. No. So, hand sanitizer? All right, there you go. That's better than nothing. <laughs> One more bathroom. Just to help with the onslaught over here. You know, we probably should go ahead and get some more snack machines in here, too. Well, you know what? Everything seems like it's going good right now. We'll just leave it alone. All right, so I'm going to see. We're going to see this Hugo guy, if he starts this class or not. Because we originally starting now. Where are you going, bud? I'm picking you up and putting you in here. This guy's gotta use the bathroom. Okay, they should be good. Everybody should be good. Okay, we should be able to get hopefully our, our first C plus. Hey, level three, look at you. Level three, baby! He's got to go to the toilet, though. I don't know why there's there's so many bathrooms here. What the heck was that? It was like a toilet monster. Okay. Oh, look at that. Well done. The students look smarter already. They better. The better they do, the more money you'll have to fund the campus. Um, hey, look at that. Monthly profit, 99.15. Fantastic. Uh, yes, you receive tuition and fees from all students enrolled in course of the campus, as well as bonuses from how much XP they're earning. 
Okay, so what's the next plan? Satisfying student needs is just one way to improve your grades. Uh, next on the agenda is a spot of study. And luckily, the students have been given their first assignments. Completing assignments is a great way for students to learn earn XP away from the classroom. Your chicken should not be pink. Look, um, though it looks like they need some new facilities. Check your inbox, see what they need. Okay. What do we got now? All right. Uh, oh, we need a library. Library orientation. Look at these books. Library plus nine people agree. Okay. Let's do it. Let's build ourselves the library. Um, I feel like the library would go fantastically right here. Put a door there. Um, how many of these do we need? Okay, and then what do we got here? Uh, Invalid for st study. Do we need this guy? It's like a little study area. Okay, so that's everything that we have to have. Now, it's $11,900. We could add a little bit more. So I say we add some windows because why not? Um, a hand sanitizer deal for sure. Um, a bin for sure. Actually, what are these? Okay, so what is this? Library reception. Okay. Uh, computer cubicle. So let's get some of those in here. And then we'll also get some desks right here next to each other. Okay, I think we are good now. Uh, let's see. Well, if it's a library, we gotta have some books, right? Yeah, so we'll have some books there. More books there. And then that looks pretty good. Oh, plants can never forget the plants. Perfect, that looks wonderful. See, look at what a, what a nice library, you know? Like what a nice library. Hire an assistant, complete an assignment in the library. Okay, so we need to hire ourselves an assistant here. Assistants, um, let's see, you're dabbing. Security breach, please change your passwords. So, uh, I guess we'll go with, with, wait, hold on, what is this? Library management, oh yeah. Comic timing makes people happy and entertain. 5% to proceed, provide comic relief. Boost library. Boost movement speed. Oh, you know what? We need to make people happy while they're in, uh, in the library, you know? Gotta make them happy. Complete an assignment in the library. Okay, so... My inbox. Welcome to your inbox. Okay, so there's nothing in here. Looking good. All right, everything's looking good. Now, how many students do we have? Does it say how many students we actually have in here? So many students completing an assignment in the library. Completing an assignment is a great way to earn XP outside of the classroom. All right. Oh, look at them. They didn't even need anything. They could have sat down at computers and stuff, but they just didn't even need to. They can just stand there. CV, it didn't happen. Not to me. All right, looking good. Wait, where where does it say how many students I have? Because I have a, I have the sinking feeling that we have a lot more students than we have capable for. Hey, let's see how the students do in their next class. Pass a scientography class with a B. So somebody got a uh, a good score on something. What is you? What's your deal? Bored. They're just bored. Feeling bored. Need some entertainment. Do we have entertainment? Hold on a second. Do we even have any entertainment values? Um, science lab, lecture theater, those. I don't see. I don't see anything for entertainment right now. Build. Are these entertainment? Increase attractiveness. These increase attractiveness. I need entertainment. Um, okay, so I don't really have anything for entertainment, but um, we could increase the fo the fountain of knowledge. We could have a fountain of knowledge right here. I feel like that should go on the outside though. Right there. Yep. Okay. Well, we don't have anything for um we don't have anything for the um entertainment it looks like, but I mean what is what are these guys doing? Dormitory wanted. Oh. Hostel. Jeez. Oh, did the teacher automatically go over here? Oh, he did. Okay, good. So the teacher does automatically move. Oh, nice. Hey, okay, hold on. What do we got here? These just finished. I don't know what actually even they, I don't know what this said. I was waiting because there's like a cube that comes out of here and I want to see it again. Uh, your students have from gone from C grade chumps to 
B grade brain heads. Let's recap how you did it, shall we? Okay. Um, campus management 101, educate. Provide better staff facilities to improve your students' grade. Make students happy and comfortable to increase their learning rate. Earn more cash by growing your campus and enrolling more students. Okay. If you don't know where your class is, it's easy enough. Congratulations, you've earned some kudos uh, for completing objectives. Spend kudos to unlock new items as well as staff outfits and interior design options. Uh, so what do we have here? What did we unlock? Oh, okay. So this, ah, entertainment. I got it. So there's different entertainment, drinks, friendships, love trumpet. What the heck is this? Uh, develop romances, sweethearts, soulmates, things like that. Okay. Uh, nonsense. So de decorative stuff, decorative stuff. Oh, look at all this stuff. Holy moly. There's a lot in here. Oh my gosh. So we have 230 kudos. Okay. So I guess now, um, unlock an item with kudos. Um, okay. Well, I know we need entertainment. Is there anything that does entertainment and something else though? Okay. So these do entertainment and increase attractiveness. However, there's not really like a lot. There's like nothing to do with it. So let's go with, and, um, let's just go with these arcade machines, meet wizard machine. Cause it's only 15 and let's see, you know what? Here we go. This would be a perfect place for this. Look at that. Perfect. And then, uh, down here we'll have another one. Perfect entertainment everywhere. Uh, employ five staff members, build a staff room. Okay. Oh, the staff room should probably go right in here. No, that's okay. We got plenty of room for stuff. Monthly profit 24 looking good. What do we got going on here? Science lab one F cheese and firecrackers, a lit mouse test. <laughs> oh, get a litmus lit mouse test. Ah, all right. Uh, let's go ahead and let's build a staff room, I guess. Oh, look at all the rooms that we have now. All right. So staff room is a minimum of three by two. Um, I feel like the staff room would go perfectly right in here. I think it will actually. Let's move these around a little bit here. Let's move that. Um, I want to move that there. This to there. And then this right there. Okay. So then we can put our staff room. Let's go ahead and get our staff room in here. Staff room. Put that in there. Put a door there. Okay. So let's see what we got in here. Um, oh, these require kudos. Ah, that's fine. We've got a couch. And then let's see, let's get a, uh, let's get another window in here. Let's get ourselves. Oh, they need their own machine. They need their own snack machines for sure. So there's that machine, that machine. Let's get another sofa in here. Maybe got to get a hand sanitizer. Trash bin. What else we got? Dartboard. Heck yeah. And then this like weird board here. I don't even know what it is, but it'll work. I feel like that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and get like a little single seater in here. There. What a wonderful staff room. All right. Staff room is good. <laughs> now we need to employ three staff members. So what I am thinking is we need to go ahead and hire another teacher. Fliss Mills. She's good at 70% teaching. We have another person coming in right now though. Cause we're going to have lecture and science, but this will give somebody a, a day off, I guess. Um, Gary Wimper, you know what, Gary, you sound like our go-to guy. Squeaky clean, exit professional hygiene starts the day with a can of burp. Wonderful. Welcome. Enjoy. And then let's get another janitor. Plagiarism is not a belief system. 
Um, oh, these guys are all maintenance people. That's fine. They're all the same. They're all the same cost and everything. Okay, let's see what we got. Uh, gross, poor personal hygiene. That's nasty. Gross, poor personal hygiene. Moves faster than most. Toilet comfort decreases. Still pinching themselves. Rapid, bottomless pit, found it in the sofa. Okay, Penelope Fenderson, you are the one. All right, we've done it. Extra credit. Um, level three science lab, complete two assignments. Okay, so what do we need for our science lab here? Uh, it is level two. Let's go ahead and crank it to level three, shall we? Where is science lab? So what could we add to our science lab? How do we actually select our science lab? Templates, rooms, overview, call janitor, pick up, sell. No, I want to work. I want to work on this room here. Here we go. Okay. Add items. Hey, there we go. All right. Whoa. What the heck are these? Thunderballs. Truly shocking. Plus 5% learning needs maintenance. Um, science shelf. Did we not put a sign? We have a science shelf in here. You know what? With a name like Thunderballs, that's really hard to, uh, oh, it's 30,000 plus 5% learning fire. power. Physics is fun. Unlock. It's Thunderballs, though. We've got. We gotta have it. Yeah. Oh, it's too big to fit in here. Um, Thunderballs is. It's too big to fit into this. <laughs> Darn it. Okay, hold on. It might actually. It might actually fit in here. Hold on. Oh my gosh, it's so close. Oh, it's so close. Okay, hold on. Maybe if I move this plant and we get that slid over and then click on here, go into here, and then we can get our thunderballs in here, maybe. Items block. What is it blocking? Oh, it's blocking the um the window. I think it's the window. Set reminders. Okay, maybe now. I'm trying to get this in here. Come on, we can do this. Really? Oh, it's blocking access to that. Darn it. Well, okay. Um. Well then. We still need to get it to be a level three room, so... Okay, level three, just because of the plants. I feel like we could probably move this, though, into a better area. Perfect. Education is non -refundable. All right, there we go. We did that. Level three science lab, complete two assignments. Oh, my gosh. We've got all kinds of things. Student lounge, water cooler, and assessment. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the student lounge. Oh man, where's the student lounge gonna be? You know what? Let's do it on this side. How big does it need to be? Three by three. Okay, so that'll work there. Um, okay, so student lounge. Alright, we need to get as much stuff in here as possible. We're gonna throw a refrigerator. We're gonna throw two refrigerators in here because that is never a terrible idea. Uh, we'll throw a sink, microwave, hand sanitizer station, uh, trash can for sure. Let's go ahead and get our blurp machines in here and a food machine. And then we need something fun in here. Um, is there anything? These are all not, these are all uh, expensive. Uh, foosball table. Ooh, an arcade thing would be fun. Oh, it's 180 kudos though. Okay, you know what? We've got the uh, we've got the machine. Let's go ahead and use that. And then let's throw some plants in here. Plant, plant anywhere. 
Perfect. That looks wonderful. End of year is approaching. All right, we've it's done it. To start trying. Unlock with 50 kudos. I can't be sure, but I think I might have feelings for somebody. If this is me, I'll find you. Um, fine. We probably need this anyways. Let's go ahead and throw this like right here in the middle of everything. Right. That'll work. Okay. And what else we got? Water cooler. Unlock with 50. Unlock in place. Yes. Okay. So the water cooler, is that for... I thought that was for students. Okay. Oh, look at our whole place. It's coming together. It's super nice. Satisfy two personal goals. Develop two best friend friendships. Oh my gosh. We are on our way here. Staff are reminded to be Develop romances, sweetheart, soulmates, level three to four. Oh, we don't have the thing that's going to develop friendships though um let's see what's that the yearly results are in wow oh Didn't we do well? hydrate and communicate drink develop friendships um oh but we need a social table enjoy your summer i know i will so we need to get to probably level one to two this will do level two to four and this will probably do three to four. Okay, so, well, somebody's using the it. Is a good time to relax and let's just, for next let's get a social table in here. There. Get some social tables in here. Why not? Congratulations, you finished the academic year. Let's see. Let's head to the end of your rewards, celebrate, and see how we did. Okay. Yay! We did a thing! Next. Graduating, zero. Continuing, 10. Average exam results, 85%. No dropouts, everybody passed. Average grade was A. Average assessment score, 86. Hey, look at us! Average environment attractiveness, 78%. Average room prestige, ugh. We are, we, so good. We did such a good job. The summer break is the perfect time to prepare for the year ahead, build facilities, make unsustainable design choices, and bask in last year's glory. Let's expand the range of our courses by starting a virtual normality course. Oh, see, now we're going to get new courses. Okay. Um, manage courses. So we offer Scientography, and then we need to add a new course. Virtual normality. Oh my gosh. So there's going to be like a whole bunch of courses that we could do. Start course. Confirm. Okay. So now I wonder if it's going to tell me at the bottom that we're going to have like multiple classes going on at the same time. Soon we'll have another group of students joining the campus. It's important to expand with our ever growing student body. Buy a new plot for your second year on campus. Um, okay. It wants me to build this. Empty with buildings by plot. Okay. So that's doing its thing. So is this going to be an outdoor plot or an indoor plot? Oh, it looks like it's going to be an indoor plot. There are a lot of jobs for janitors around the campus, no considering hiring some janitors. Oh, yeah, it just added like a whole new, a whole nother building. Okay. Oh, that's super cool. So now we have like our, wait, is this second years? Wait, so are you going to tell me that this is like first year, second year, so on and so forth? No way. The campus just got bigger. Before starting a new year, better. be sure to check any unresolved campus requirements. Um, VR lab, virtual normality teacher, and a lecture theater. Oh, okay. So now we need to build those things. Um, I feel like we should probably keep them together though. I feel like we should utilize, fully utilize this area before we start utilizing this area. So lecture theater, let's go ahead and do, um, you know what? Let's do a, let's do a VR in here. Another lecture theater right here. Maybe. Oh my gosh. What the heck is this machine? Staff are reminded to care about okay. students. 
Invalid chair. Okay, so we need some chairs in here for something. And then, what is this? VR headsets? Did anyone forget their goggles? Oh, yeah. I need that. And what is this? Is this what we just added? I feel like it's what we just added. What about a desk? Okay. I feel like we're good. Hand sanitizer. Trash bin. Plant. Golden. Oh, that's 50,000. Oh, that was expensive. Lecture theater. Okay, so now we need a lecture theater and we need a virtual normality teacher. Let's go ahead and let's go with Spencer Goth Hancock. Students are reminded that you came here on purpose. And then we need one more lecture theater, which should be easy enough. Lecture theater. We're going to go ahead and do the same thing that we got going on here. Um, we're going to basically just go ahead and mimic what we've got. It just works out too easy, you know? Mm, throw a screen in there. Hand sanitizer. Plant. Plant. What else do we need? Do we need anything else? Probably not. I think we're good. Oh my gosh, look at that. Fantastic. Okay. Now, before we get going any further, we probably should go... Oh, what is this? What's going on here? Who's having this thing above them? What does this mean? Room capacity is at seven. Oh, that means that there's too many people in there. Okay. So this is the thing that we need to figure out too, is we probably should go ahead and build this wing in right here with more dormitories and bathrooms. Because if we're gonna have more people, that probably would be a good idea. Oh, we don't have a shower room yet either. Okay, so let's do this. Let's get a dormitory going. We're gonna do a dormitory here. Perfect. Uh, we'll go ahead and get some beds in here. Okay, so there's another dormitory, but then let's go ahead and let's hit up a shower room, and then we'll also hit up a bathroom too. I'm not really sure what the shower room's gonna entail. Okay, there's a, a room full of showers. <laughs> It's like, that's literally all it is. It's just a room full of showers. I love it. Um, and then it can't literally fit anything else. So that'll work. Um, a bunch of showers. And then we probably should get another bathroom in here. Okay. That looks pretty good. All right. So we've got shower room, bathrooms. We got another dormitory right here. That looks pretty good. I think that'll, uh, that'll deal with our stuff. Now it says there's a lot of janitorial stuff going on. Um, we probably should also go ahead and just get some more, uh, trash bins around the place oh and then actually we probably should go ahead and get some more food and stuff like that in here okay so that looks pretty good we've got a fountain out here should we throw another fountain inside i feel like we should throw another fountain inside and then i feel like we need some of these shrubs too throw one there and then we'll throw one here look at that oh my gosh it's beautiful okay i think we're good now so we got bins throughout the place oh we need to hire another janitor i think so let's go ahead and get another janitor um happiness and faster oh you'll work okay time for year two um oh 10 course points manage courses can we add oh it says zero courses available Okay, and start next year. Um, are you sure you want to start the next year with the following courses? Scientography, virtual normality, student intake, student intake, 10 course points to spend, start next year. All right, here we go. Pass a virtual normality class with a grade C. Oh, this is gonna be exciting, this is exciting, okay. What else do we need? Did you know that some students sit around all day? It's true, may I suggest additional seating options? Thank you. Uh, park bench? Yeah, why not? There. Some park benches. Easy enough. A love bench? You want to unlock the love bench? Yeah, sure. Put it over here, kind of in the corner. You know what? We'll throw one over here, too. Should we throw one inside, too? Yeah. Oh. We can't. We have to have them outside. Okay. All right. So... 
Shield, Holy Odyssey. moly. Okay, so now we've got VR Lab 1, Lecture Theater 1, and Science Lab 1 all running at the same time. Do the time table has now been published. we actually Schedule have... Your lives accordingly. Um, oh, yes, we do. Okay, so we do have two Scientology people. So we have one for the one for the Science Lab, one for the Lecture Hall, one for VR. Okay, so that will be good. Perfect. I was a little bit worried. You know, I like how we had to buy this building over here. We didn't even utilize it for anything whatsoever. Oh, that's funny. Oh, okay. So somebody needs a records cubicle for an assignment. Um, textbook cubicle, study, computer. We don't have a records cubicle. What is a records cubicle? Giant li ri library reception. Records cubicle. Yeah, okay. Well, here. Let's get uh, let's get those in there. Hey, look at that. Campus leveled up. Fantastic. Okay, so that's easy enough. Uh, statement. August year two. Staff wages. Yep, that's okay. Oh, easy enough. Should put another door into the library right here and move this. Actually, let's go ahead and do that. Just add another door right there so they can actually get in from both sides. Easy enough. I feel like everybody's doing good. I don't see anybody with any negative things going on right now either. Like I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out like what's going on here. So this room is over occupancy, I think. We're experiencing a weed infestation on campus. Where is this weed infestation? We're in for a soggy stretch, a wet patch of time. It's that rainy, muggy and dank. It may not be fair one, but I'm sure the weeds will enjoy it. Weeds make the campus ground less attractive, but it can be removed by a janitor. Uh, where's the weeds at? Uh oh, that's not good. I think we need a bigger student's room too. Cause that one is constantly at capacity. Staff are reminded that dogs don't eat homework. <gasps> is that a weed? Oh my gosh. I can't do anything with the weed. It won't let me select it or anything. Oh, janitor's going to take care of it. Okay. What's going, on? What's going on here? Hey! Star rating increase. New campus unlocked. Huzzah. Yeah! All right! Hot dog kiosk, coffee kiosk, and a whale fountain. Oh, very nice. Um, assistant needed in library one. Oh, okay. We probably should get more people, more staff too, huh? Oh my gosh. We need so many more people. Okay, so we got another assistant here. I think we need to get another student lounge area. We're going to put it right in here. And let's finish it off with... Let's finish it off with a plant. That hits level three. Yes, it will. Okay. So that will hopefully... Does it say how many people? Okay, room capacity is seven. So that'll help with that room. Okay, and then what's going on with this guy? This guy looks like he is tired. Needs a rest. Minus... Okay, so let's go ahead and let's get some more uh, teachers in here too. Because it looks like they're getting worked to death. Okay, and then we also need to place a coffee kiosk, which I have a feeling that this is going to be super popular. So there's that, and then statement. Okay, accept that. Okay, we are all caught up on messages. We got a, another teacher in here to hopefully help this guy. We got another room here to hopefully help with that. I think we're good. Uh, what is this? Assistant required. What? Oh, somebody has to work there? Oh, okay. So let's get another assistant. Um, boost movement speed. I guess you can go here. Sells food and drink. Okay. All right. We should be good. Uh, what is going on here? Oh, there's people waiting. That's what that means. There's people waiting for these, uh, for the bookshelves. 
Hold on a second. Let's get uh, these. Let's throw that in there. Yeah, there's people waiting for bookshelves. Okay, so each like each thing has its own like its own queue kind of thing. So if I see these numbers pop, like so this room is that room is super popular right now. We need another library. Oh my gosh. Okay, but I think everything else looks pretty good. Um Yeah. Oh, why? Why? Why do you have to just throw it on the floor? Nasty people. Hey, we got campus level eight. Awesome. Um, so we're trying to get, uh, we're trying to earn 150,000 and we're trying to satisfy 10 personal goals. So I'm hoping that, so I'm hoping that we'll be able to hit those here shortly. And I'm also trying just to answer these things as, as we go, uh, to Scientology applicants. Open day report the day was successful. Okay, so we got two more students, and then here's our tuition fees, rent, XP bonus, staff wages, monthly profit. Okay. Looking pretty good. I want to try to finish out year two and see how things go. Okay, so we are uh we've earned the money. We've got the average dormitory rating, and but we need to get our campus level up. So what I'm thinking is maybe we can do some exterior things here. Um, there's this like park, but it's super expensive. There's also like a weightlifting area, a car. There's this like lover tree thing. Um, but we do actually have this whale fountain. Which, I mean, I feel like it's hard to say no to a whale fountain. You know what I'm saying? Um, and then let's get a, a magic ball in here. I'm hoping that we can hit this campus level um, as we also as we also are getting people learned it <laughs> this should uh, it should start increasing as well uh, science station required A science lab okay um where is hold on is this the science lab this is the science lab one okay so we might actually be able to place it in here hold on Uh, what was it? It was, was this a science station? Perfect. All right. So that looks good. We need to get campus level nine and as people get learned, learned it, we should uh, hopefully increase that. All we need is oh, just a little bit more. The administrator is reminded to stay hydrated. Tuition fees may be spent on administrative... Hey, we did it! Two-star rating. Bath time statue. Fantastic. 20,000, 150 kudos. Awesome. And that is going to end this episode. We did it. We did the things. We did the stuff. And I believe we can actually save and go to the map now, too. Uh, let's go ahead and quick save. And let's go take a picture of the map. Do you want to save? Uh, we just saved. Yeah, look at this. Uh, new campus unlocked P uh, Piazza Lantra now available. Fantastic. So we've got this place, um, Fresh Lee Meadows, and then that place. This is the only two places that we have right. Oh no, we have Minton Universe. Oh wait, get a star there. Noble Steed. Oh, I want Noble Steed. Look at, there's like a castle there. Oh, that's super cool. All right, so the Freshly Meadows, we, we did that. Um, I think next time we're gonna check out the uh, Piazza Lantera, and then hopefully maybe after that one, we can hit up uh, Mitten and then Noble Seed as well. So I don't know, um, but yes, thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, this is Two Point Campus. I'll link down below to it on Steam. And um, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Leave a comment, let me know. Let me know if you wanna see more. I had a blast playing. There's a lot of stuff to do. Um, and I'm curious to see like all the, um, all the different like course types too, so. I think it'll be a lot of fun, but yeah. Thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.